What a day. I needed to like blow off some steam from the horrible day I had. If you follow me on Instagram and, and if you are friends with me on Facebook, you will know the day that I went through today and it was, it was not great. It was not great at all. Got cat called three times never been catcalled before and I hate it. <laughs> What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cha Cha and I do makeup. Today I am going to be doing a tutorial. If you're new here, I do get ready with me's. I do speed makeup videos and uh, this will be I think one of the more intensive uh, tutorial videos I have I am doing today. Today's tutorial is this eye look that was requested by a friend of mine named Amanda on my Facebook page. She wanted a step-by-step -step tutorial and I did it on live but the thing was is that I also did an unboxing live for my friend Chris Michael who has a company called Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics and the look I'm doing today is actually going to be from Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. Today's video is brought to you by Versus Enigma. So Versus Enigma is a brand started by Hayden Ditto back in 2016. It's still a relatively new brand, but it's also been featured in Voyage LA, which is a website. Anyways, <laughs> so basically, uh, what is that? Versus Enigma is a clothing brand for streetwear uh, fashion at an affordable price and this is the Blind for Love t-shirt. It's a crop top shirt. I really like it. It only cost me about $29 which is pretty inexpensive for most streetwear fashion. Most streetwear fresh fashion ranges in the higher prices but if you use the code cha cha at checkout you get 15% off your order and that is freaking awesome they have some really awesome clothes I just got a beanie in and I'm also going to be getting I don't really own slides because I think they're ugly but the versus enigma slides are going to be coming out soon they are made they are made of Italian leather and uh, apparently they have really awesome quality comfort. I can't wait to get them and to show them to you guys. So don't forget Versus Enigma at checkout. Use the code ChaCha at checkout for 15% off your first, your order. Your order if you order with my code. So that's awesome. But yes, so today's video I'm doing the tutorial of this eyeshadow look using only Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics products. So that includes the brushes as well that I'll be using today. So the colors that I'm using, I will name them out in the video. I'm also going to be naming the lipsticks that I'll be using, which first of all, so I got these lashes. I did a live of this, but I got these lashes in its own freaking container. This is a little storage box for the lashes and if you could tell they're freaking beautiful they're light they last and the glue that they come with which Chris Michael gives you lasts all day the lipstick that I'm currently wearing comes in this very bougie looking container and it came in a box with the lashes with the glue and with lip liner for only $20 it was a $20 mystery box the palette was a gift, but I'm going to be give, showing the price right here. If you don't know who Chris Michael is, what rock did you just crawl out of? She is an up-and-coming uh, beauty guru whose steps I hope to follow here in the Rio Grande Valley. And she is going to be doing great things. She's just got so much talent. She has a code. Uh, use code WATERMELON at checkout and receive 20% off your next purchase. So I really hope you guys order from ChrisMichaelVanityCosmetics.com and if y'all do go and if y'all start following her, if you start going to her Facebook page, tell her Cha Cha sent you. So yeah, uh, I'm going to be just talking about all of the products that I'm using today. I also wanted to make, not well not products that I'm using today, but I am going to be doing just a quick step-by-step -step tutorial. I also wanted to let all of my fans, my current fans on this channel know, and I'm going to let know on my second channel, I am running a Patreon. If you don't know what Patreon is, it's a website that allows artists to kind of get money from their own work, 
but in this sense the money will be going towards the betterment of this channel and my ASMR channel uh, it, the money that I make from my patreon which it is a monthly subscription you will be getting one-on-one -on -one chats if you join my patreon you will also be getting exclusive sneak peeks and if you request something whether it be an ASMR video or whether it be a makeup video or anything else at all uh, the request can be done on my Patreon for about $3, $9, and $25 a month. They do vary in tiers. I will be updating those tiers at some point. Um, the Patreon is definitely going to help me out uh, with the continuement with the continuing and betterment of this channel. I also want to share with y'all a little something. I run a jewelry Facebook page with my mom and we are well not just jewelry but it's all creations I am currently doing let's see if I can so we'll put a picture of these so I'm going to be doing a raffle of these earrings right here I will be doing a close-up right now or a picture the uh, earrings will be done at a raffle for two dollars a ticket and the winner will be announced at the end of this month. So yeah, I hope you guys uh, will take part in that. The earrings um, are, I was selling these earrings for $6, but now I'm going to be doing a $2 raffle on them. Uh, the reason for that is just, it, it's cause I'm trying to get rid of them. Um, yeah, I do have my own pair. I have these earrings that I sell. These are little bubble tea earrings. I'm gonna try and take a picture and put them right here. So, uh, and I will be putting the ca my cash app here as well in case if y'all are interested in that raffle. So, uh, let's just get on with the video. Okay, so this is the finished look. I'm gonna go ahead and continue actually showing y'all how to do this eyeshadow look on this side right here. I just kind of wanted to show you the finished product before I actually go on to doing the makeup. Okay, so I've already started by doing my brow i just did a very simple brow today with um starting my little brow. so today i'm just starting off by doing a simple brow i by doing just a regular everyday brow where i really don't put too much effort on it i start off by using the color pop color pop brow boss gel and I use this in dark brown and then I go over with a powder just to fill in a little bit of uh, the rest of my brow. Kind of define it, bring the tail of the arch out a little more. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Powder Duo, Duo in Chocolate. So as you can see, I've already hit pan here and I've already got another one ready to go to use. So, the first... Then after that, um, after you, after you add your brow and then you clean up your brow around, I like to always put on my eye makeup before my foundation. Sorry, I'm like, oh, I'm having a weird time tonight. So you're gonna start off by adding your base. Today's base is going to be the P. Louise base in white. And this is going to be the foundation for your eyeshadow. I like to use a brow after applying it for a little bit. I like to use the brow after applying it on my eyelid. Not the brow, the brush. I like to use the brush after applying it on my eyelid so that way we can absorb a little bit more of those oils. Just make sure you get the entirety of your eye. So now with the Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics palette, we are going to go in with a very tight dome brush. I know that this one's a little dirty, but this is what we're going to use. So. We are going to go in the corner with Gorge. We're going to come into this part of the eye first. We're going to pack it in right there. And we're going to be sure to come up here from the corner of the eye. We're going to go a little bit onto the brow space. 
and we're just gonna go over half of the half of the eye lid then we're gonna come in with Mia on the outer area we're gonna come into the outer lid and remember the first third of your eye is going to be with the yellow the last third of your eye is going to be in the blue Remember, we're going to bring it out onto the brow bone. Then we're going to take a fluffy brush. This is another brush from the Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics line. And we're going to start off with the yellow. We're going to take some more Gorge. We're going to bring it outwards. But then we're also going to bring the blue in and we're going to meet it in the middle. It's going to make a very greenish tone. Now. We're going to come in with Angel, and we're going to blend the blue a little bit more outwards, but we're going to come in to the middle. We're going to meet the yellow onto the better part of the yellow shade. We're just going to take some more Mia, we're going to blend it just a little bit together. You don't have to cover the entirety of the eye, you just want to make sure you get this very well blended out. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take a very uh, painty looking brush and we're going to come back in with our P. Louise. When I say painty looking brush, I mean just a very thin uh, detailing brush. So we're going to come in with the P. Louise base. We're going to get our detail brush. This is actually the lip brush from uh, Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics from his line, but I'm going to use this for the detailing. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come above the crease. And you're just going to want to... Curve it. Onto the blue and then you're going to want to paint it downwards. I like to say paint. We're just gonna dab it just a little bit. And I like to dab it with my finger a little bit so it gets off that extra. Now, you're going to come in on the white with So Fetch. You're just going to... It's... It, I got to hand it to you, Chris Michael. You really did make Fetch happen. You don't really want to brush it on, you actually want to pack it on. But for the sake of today, yep, that's what we're going to do. And you're going to want to 
dab this so that way the color blends and we're gonna come back in so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come back in with Mia on the outer corner and then we're gonna take another clean blending brush I had it here somewhere great and we're gonna come back in on the inner corner with the gorge. Now we are gonna take the packable brush and we're gonna come into the corner of the eye with shine on them. a little bit of highlighter from the palette okay. now we're gonna line and then I'm going to finish up the rest of my face and then I'm gonna add the lashes on so I'll be right back alrighty so here we're back I've already done uh, this half of my face now I'm gonna go ahead and apply the lashes that I got so this is again from Chris Michael. Oh, you cannot see. It's really hard to see, but it's a really pretty, uh, it's not just pretty, it's a beautiful little compact eyelash holder. And these eyelashes are in, oh, sorry. These eyelashes are, in Af are named Aphrodite. They're very beautiful. They have a beautiful holder in the compact mirror. And this is, these are the lashes. I'm really sorry if like the camera is having a hard time focusing right now. Yeah, there we go. So I'm going to apply this with the Chris Michael Vanity Cosmetics glue. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to apply the glue first. And I'm actually just going to let it sit there for a little bit. And Chris Michael has his own glue that she, uh she packages with the items with the eyelashes now that i have the glue on my lashes i have it on the pair of tweezers and i'm just gonna blow it I'm gonna apply. It's my first time actually applying lashes on camera. And I did not do that great. Hold up. <laughs> There we go. Alrighty, so now that I have both of those, what I'm going to do next is I'm actually going to apply the Essence Lash and Brow Gel Mascara. And the reason for that is because I'm going to comb these two together. I'm going to comb the lash and the fake lashes together. And it's not to lengthen them or anything because they're already long. It's just to kind of mold them together. Okay. And 
I'm just going to add the blush. So I'm just going to talk a little bit. I know I've already done my whole face, but I just want to talk a little bit about the lashes overall. Is I usually cannot wear lashes, period. It I last with them for probably just a few seconds for just a few minutes and then I'm already struggling with them they're too heavy I just I can't with them the rest of the night so usually I take them off and I don't even wear them every day but I have to say the Chris Michael lashes are absolutely lightweight then the glue that he gives you is amazing it really does last you all day so and they're very lightweight and they look real that's the best part is the fact that they look so real when I put them on my mom told me she she just thought I got lash extensions that day but I told her no okay so this is the lip liner that I got I'm gonna write the name right here in the subtitles the reason for that is because I really don't remember the name of this lipstick and then I'm going to finish it off with the Chris Michaels lipstick so this is going to be a type of uh, ombre, if you will. Ombre. Wow. I overdrew. you. go all right and I know I know you're thinking that it looks a little weird but I'm actually gonna come in with the Chris Michael vanity cosmetics lipstick this is it right here this is my favorite thing out of the mystery box that I got so I'm just gonna apply it and it blends beautifully Yeah, the lip liner and the actual lipstick are different colors, but I kind of like it because it does give it a little bit of an ombre look. Now, here's what I have to say about this lipstick in particular. This lipstick is definitely mask proof. I wore this lipstick all day with my Sailor Moon mask. And it did not mark it at all, and I freaking loved it. So yeah, this is the uh, look that was requested by my friend Amanda. If y'all like today's video and if y'all want to uh, see something a little different, I will be doing Halloween videos coming up soon. So uh, hopefully y'all guys like them. And I hope y'all tune in to uh, my Instagram. I will be announcing when I will be going live on there so we can do live uh, makeup and unboxings together. And uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. So I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. And uh, leave a comment, like, subscribe this video, and please share with your friends. Uh, so that way, you know, you could just show some love. And don't forget my Patreon link down below and my second ASMR channel. Just a reminder, I am selling these earrings. And I am having a giveaway for a pair of beautiful Japanese earrings that I will that are right here I'll probably be putting a picture right here but yeah if you're interested in these I will I will put the cash app down below for a raffle 
and uh, that's all so I I'm glad you liked today's video and um, yeah oh and also the versus enigma this remember this is the uh, blind for love t-shirt from Ver the brand versus enigma I will be putting their Instagram link right here and don't forget to use code cha cha at checkout and I hope y'all have a great day and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!